what's going on, man? We back at it like a bad habit. Back watching some ghost videos. It's been a minute, and I was looking for a good way to watch some videos. Luckily, I've been watching some other reactions, and I've found um, a good, very good reactor. Shout out to Casper Sight. I think that's what his name is, right? Yeah. Casper Sight. Shout out to Casper Sight. Um, he has definitely a good setup where his box is, well, his camera sight is out of the way um, most of the time. Most of the time his camera sight is out of the way of where the apparition or um, entity is showing up. So I'm going to try that angle because uh, normally I have my box right here on the side. So we're going to try that angle and see what happens. Hopefully I stay out of the sight most of the time. Um, but I do know having the box right here on certain videos is a little annoying. So let's go ahead and try that. See what's going on. So just letting you know, this is not my meth, not my original idea. It's probably not his original idea neither, but this is what we're gonna do. So let's go ahead and jump into this thing, see what's going on and uh, catch these ghosts the figures and what they're doing here because they're out here terrorizing people you know what ghosts do i don't know what i would do if i man and i used to like i said in my other videos i used to stay in the house with a ghost and now man, i don't know i think i could decrease just a little bit just a little bit all right, hopefully we good, hopefully we good. Shout out to my junkie. Top 10 scary ghost videos behind you. This first creepy video was uploaded to YouTube by Sarah Sager and- My bad, I just wanted to make sure I click on this so I don't- And he's titled, You Stop Tell Me, Ghost or Not. One evening while Sarah and her partner were on a video call, she noticed something rather creepy appear behind him. Thanks, mine. I'm I video guess, recording uh, here. Wait. What the fuck was that? What was that? Something rather creepy appear behind him. I'm video recording here. Wait. I just seen a something. Really? Hi, Stacy. You look scary. Did you catch it? It happened so fast that if you blink, you'll miss it. At first, Sarah's partner appears to be alone. However, seconds later, some sort of figure appears to hover in the air right behind him. The mysterious figure is only there for a split second before it disappears, never to be seen again. Sarah noticed the strange figure hovering above her partner's shoulder and uploaded it to the internet in an- It's his ex-girlfriend. Damn attempt to get answers on just <laughs> what it could be. So what do you think? Is this a ghost caught on camera or not? You tell me. If you're a fan of scary videos, make sure you subscribe and hit the bottom of the cinema. Now it's time to find out about dude's past. <laughs> These creepy clips were uploaded to the TikTok account Resiux. Resiux explains that he works in a movie theater and late one night while he was working the closing shift, he oh, captured, yeah. quote, the scariest thing he's ever seen. Movie theater so, uh, the worst. I work in a movie theater and we, uh, we have to check the theaters at night. You know, once you're done closing as an usher, you just flash the camera. You gotta check the door. And then you have to check behind these curtains just to make sure no hobos are back here. You know, no one's back here. And then you just go and I don't know if hobos is the best word to use. Uh, is that something up here? I feel like something's up in the projector room. Yeah, look at the window, right? Yeah, I feel like something is up there. That's wild. I've seen that before I even looked down at the caption. That's wild. What the f Whoa. That wasn't even the right window. And then you just go and... What that wasn't in the right window. It's this window. Okay, I'm not. I'm looking at the wrong thing. It was this window. That's wild. No one's back here. And then you just go and. 
Yep. What the f I just saw somebody up here and it's the scariest I've ever seen, dude. Like, I'm like, I was just down here and I was back down there in that corner right there. And I literally just like can't. What the f What the f While doing the final checks in the auditorium, Resiuk spots a dark figure peeking through the projection booth window. It's quite hard to see, but if we zoom in, we can do? see something dark peeking out. As a worker, what do you do in that situation? What do you do? Do you go further investigate? Do you like, do you just walk away? I'm gonna walk away. All right, I'm, all right, all right, brother. Uh, you know, you got it. <laughs> you got it, you got it, you got it, you, you got me. I, first of all, I wouldn't have went up there by myself. That's for damn sure. I wouldn't have went up there by myself. And that's not going to happen. Um, you know, one of my homies got to go up there with me. You know. That ain't, ugh. Yeah, that's scary. That's scary right there, bro. That's terrifying. Terrifying. Out before it quickly ducks away out God. of view. Resiut goes up to investigate, and at first, the room seems empty. But then, right at the opposite side of the room, someone or something yeah. can be seen peeking out before it quickly slips away. TikTok viewers were left terrified by these creepy clips. Many agree that the cinema Resiux works at is haunted. But what do you think? Is this something paranormal or is it all just for views? You tell me. I don't know, but it's time to No say, motion it detected. I found this creepy clip on the TikTok account, Alicia Syke. Now, before I go any further, I'd just like to mention that Alicia's account has absolutely nothing to do with ghosts, paranormal, fake videos, or anything like that. Her account is all about traveling, shopping, and her everyday life. However, Alicia uploaded this particular video looking for answers about some weird things that had been happening in her grandmother's house. So if there's any like supernatural or like spirity people that can explain these next videos, please watch this. So my nanny passed away a couple of weeks ago and my mom has been clearing out her house. My nanny has a camera installed on the inside of her house, so it just faces her living room, her front door and her stairs. Um, you'll see it in the next clips, but um, the past couple of days something really weird has happened. So no one else has a key to my nanny's house apart from my mum, so that's really important for this. So this is the first step. Here is my mum leaving my nanny's house. This is where I'm happy to go. Um, and she doesn't come back until the next morning. So there's nothing on the floor. There's nothing in sight. Specifically at the door, there's nothing left there. So my mum leaves, doesn't come back, and nobody else comes in the house. This is in the next morning. My mum is so confused because there's a gift bag left at the door. Nobody has had access to this house. The ring camera didn't pick up any motion in between my mum leaving and my mum arriving back with any person detected. So this is what um, was left at the door. She's so confused. She says she remembers leaving that bag upstairs. There's a pair of slippers in it. Captured on a motion detection camera inside Alicia's grandmother's home, we can see Alicia's mother leaving through the front door. However, when she returns the next morning, a gift bag has mysteriously appeared next to the door. And what makes this so bizarre is that the camera records constantly 24 seven, but no motion was detected in between her mother leaving and returning. Alicia mentions that nobody, only Alicia's mother has access to her grandmother's home. So just how did this gift bag appear by the door? Well, just take a look at this. This video is not edited, watch right here. I'm just gonna show it again. That mug just spawned. GTA code. L2, R2, R1, L1, up, down, right, left. <laughs> X square, triangle, circle. <clears throat> Head ass. That shit just spawned out of nowhere. That's crazy. 
in what Alicia says is an unedited video. The gift bag bizarrely appears out of nowhere. No motion detected, no cuts, no people. Just a gift bag appearing out of nowhere. Alicia's viewers were left stunned by this video she uploaded to TikTok, with several commenting saying they encountered similar unexplainable events after their family members passed away. And many agree that it's likely her grandmother placed the bag there. But what do you think happened here in Alicia's grandmother's house? Let me know down below. Wow. What are those? Did she pass away in the house? This next ghost video. Oh, Hello, question. you beautiful people. How the devil are you? Huh? Casper's sight? Mate, you weren't planning to do another one without me, were you? Anyway, I found this freaky deaky ghosty woasty video clip, mate, that is gonna mess you up. Just wait until you see it, okay? Just check this out, mate. Ljudi, učinili mu se, ne znam da li je moguće, ne znam da ste vidli, ili mislim možda što sam sam ovde, kao da mi se učinilo, ne znam da ste vidli, molim vas zavratite, molim vas zavratite, kao da je imao nešto gore. Ošte ne mogu da shvatim da li je senka od nečega, jer ovde oko mene, pogledajte, pogledajte ljudi, samo je mrak i učinilo mi se, pogledajte, nema nigde ništa. Ništa se ne vidi. Ništa ne vidi mi dalje. While the man is high up on the mountain surrounded by darkness, he spots some sort of totem in the distance. He moves closer to it and then two giant white apparition like things appear either side of the totem. The man yeah. decides to take a closer it's look, like but as he gets up close to the totem, his camera starts to lose focus and neither of the huge apparitions can be seen from close up. He steps back to take another look from where he first saw them and then this happens. Are they back? They're moving? What should we say called them? I know I'm not tripping, bro. I know I just saw it move, bro. I know I just, yeah, I, I know I just saw it move, bro. I know I'm not tripping, bro. Like, the, I, the hands just did this. Yeah, yeah, the hands just did that. I know I'm not tripping. Bro. Bro, bro. Get the fuck out of there. What is you doing? You brave. <laughs> you brave, son. Either you brave or you dumb. They just close their hands again. Now they reaching out. F that shit, mate. I would have been long gone. Well, I yeah. wouldn't. I just Rambo stuff. Yeah, yeah, I wouldn't have been but there. Most people, mate, would have been long gone. Yeah. Mother I'm gone. Yeah. I'm gone. Yeah. I'm gone. Yeah. <laughs> How nice of Casper Sight to stop by. Let's go over the clip, shall we? From a few steps back, the two huge apparition-like figures can be seen Clearly again, moving. but something about them is even clearer. These gigantic white figures, seen from a distance, now appear to be moving. And the explorer, instead of ramboing it, decides to just get out of there. So, just what are these strange giant things this explorer caught on video? Are they ghosts or something? 
something else. Let me know your thoughts on this one down in the comments. I don't know. Also, make sure you head over to Casper Sight's channel and subscribe. His content is absolutely epic and his community is one of the best you could ever be a part of. Big I'll bad. leave a link to Casper Sight's channel in the description so you can check out his channel after the video. Big facts, funny guys. Disputed guy. haunting. This next creepy video clip comes from TikTok, uploaded by Smug Puppy. Now, I've featured Smug Puppy before, where he showed some kind of convincing footage oh, captured around his okay. supposedly haunted home. Since this. featuring these clips, Smug Puppy has uploaded dozens more quote paranormal video clips to his TikTok account. However, okay. many users questioned the authenticity of Smug Puppy's clips and branded him a liar. And I don't know how people are questioning these clips, bro. He really got slapped by a ghost. Like, that shit smacked the shit out of his ass, bro. Like, <laughs> there was no way that was fake. The videos as straight up that. fakes. In fact, it's the outrage became now? so okay. widespread sure. that paranormal investigation. Maybe, maybe the ghost is finding this shit funny, but he really got the shit smacked out of him. Team started creating angry videos, slamming Smug Puppy's videos. So, oh. in an attempt to defend himself and back up his claims that his videos, videos aren't bro. faked, Smug Puppy uploaded this video. Hi guys. Uh, in an effort to prove that these shadow things are real, so we've been, been having move, this all bro. day today, or I have, I've been here. We've got shadow figures uh, peeking around this door today, and we can see them on the front screen of the camera. Yeah. So okay. what we decided to do in an effort to prove that... Ain't no fucking way. In an effort to prove... Ain't, ain't no way that's a person. I know they got another kid in the house, but... He moved back way too fast for that to be an actual kid, bro. Prove that. Look. Look how fast they move back. And, like, let me look at the way the kid moved back and look at the way he's edited. In an effort to prove that. Look. See? And then the way he was edited, because he moved at the same time that the way this person moved, there's no way. There's In no an way. effort to prove that. They moved at the same time. In an effort to prove that these are There's real, no way. I've made Kaylee sit. Thanks. <laughs> sit really close, and she's gonna grab the camera as soon as we Look. see one. And I'm pretty oh sure it screams God, pretty hard to see from here. To be yeah. fair, but we've tried to push it back to get the best view. She's gonna grab the camera and get it upstairs because there's literally nowhere to go on the stairway. You there's no. It. Yeah, you'd hear somebody running up the stairs. There's no other rooms to go in. So, you know what I mean? That's what we're doing. So, I don't want to get ready, Kays. I'm pretty sure. Don't cover the screen. Because people say, oh, you've cut the video. Yeah. Yeah. Just try and grab it the best you can. Uh, yeah, That's go, two. go, go, go. Quick, 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 quick. Nope. Ain't no way. Show everywhere. Well, there's nowhere ready to show. Ain't no way, bro. And then there would have been somebody there. There would have been somebody there, bro. There would have been somebody there, bro. There would have been somebody there, bro. Ain't no way, bro. It was two of them, bro. Just try and grab it the best you can. Uh, yeah, go, go. Look at that. Look how the fast that one moved. Just try and grab it the best you can. Uh, yeah, go, go, go. Quick, 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 Okay. Behind Smug Puppy, a dark figure peeks its head out a couple of times before ducking away. The pair then wait for the perfect opportunity to show that there are no cuts in the video. Then two dark figures peek out behind the door, but literally seconds later, when she gets to where the figures were seen, no one's there. Yeah. Smug Puppy gained his credibility back after publishing this video, I mean, which is quickly... I mean, like, how do you not... I 
I was dealing with a lag. I'm glad I caught it. But yeah, ain't no way. Racked up almost 10 million views since it was uploaded on the 16th of February this year. Even big influencers such as Daz Black have taken an interest in Smug Puppy's videos. But what do you think? Is Smug Puppy's home really haunted by shadow figures? Yeah. Let me know what you think. Yeah. Marked. Sure. This next horrifying video comes from the Japanese ghost hunting YouTube channel, Takuchi Camera. Takuchi ventures out to conduct a paranormal investigation at an abandoned school, which he's been told is haunted. In the video, Takuchi makes his way through the abandoned school. He aims to find a restroom to set up his equipment as it's easier to stay out of sight in there. While finding his way there, he passes a quote, cursed chair in the corridor. He eventually reaches the restroom, sets up his equipment and performs a ritual, which turned out to be a very, very bad idea. Hanako-san, asobimashou. Hanako-san, Asobi Masho. It sounds like a bad idea. Why? Why? Ha na kosam. Uh huh. Asobi Masho. Oh, three times. Okay. Not Great. Okay. Fuck me up too. Shh. え、ま、家帰って映像確認したら。なんか映ってるパターンもあるから。おお、びっくりした。あかん。急に鏡わかんて。<笑> At first, it seems as if the summoning ritual didn't work, but upon further inspection, it seems as if it did. But I have to ask, did you catch it? No. As Takuchi turns away from the mirror, a hand from someone or something can be seen resting on his shoulder and Takuchi has no idea it's there. Takuchi's viewers were quick to point out this mysterious hand resting on his shoulder and many say that what- I didn't see that. I definitely did not see that. No ghost. My ear そう。あ、まあ、いいか。ええ、そう確認したら。なんか映ってるパターンもあるから。おお、びっくりした。あかん。急に鏡わかんて。急に鏡わかん。How do you see the hand? Now? Oh, you can see the hand clearly. Damn, that motherfucker right there. That motherfucking hand is right there. Wow. Alright. Touche. Touche. Mm -mm. Thing in this abandoned school? Let me know what you think in the comments. How you mark? Man, it's I'm watching you. you. Hand on you, son. This creepy video comes I'm from the TikTok you, account Hey It's Bell UWU. Late at night, while Bell was asleep, she was awoken <laughs> by the feeling of something watching her. Okay. She looked out of her window and noticed a light in a doorway across the street was on. Bell decides to record a video and snap some pictures for her travel blog. I woke up with the feeling something was watching me. I looked out my window and noticed a light on in a doorway. 
The street looked pretty at night, so I took some pictures for my travel blog. At first, nothing looks out of the ordinary. However, when Belle developed the photos, she was absolutely horrified by what she saw. Uh, what is that? In the developed photo taken by Belle, someone or something with glowing eyes and long bony fingers can be seen lurking in the lit doorway opposite Belle's house. And whatever it is, appears to be looking back at her, perhaps watching her like she originally thought. You see that? That's out there in the alleys. In the shadows lurking. The shit in the movies might be real. Y'all better be out here training for the fucking uh, demon world or some shit, bro. What the fuck? You gonna run up on this in the alleyway? What you gonna do? It's gonna fuck you up. God damn it. But what do you think? Did TikTok user Hey It's Bell UWU photograph a terrifying apparition watching her from down the street? Or is it just Photoshop? Drop a comment below with your thoughts on this it, one. It could be. I'm How not. is this possible? That's crazy. This next bizarre but creepy video was recorded and uploaded to TikTok by Leslie XO and went viral it's due not. to just how strange it I'm is. I'm terrified if it's not Photoshop. <laughs> this man came from the future. This man that came from the future. Ain't no way that's not real. How did you just spawn out of nothing? He said, Por qué? <laughs> While an ordinary news interview is taking place, the live cameras captured a man appearing through what looks like a portal. But the question is, just where did he come from? TikTok viewers were left stunned by this bizarre event occurring on live TV, with many comments stating that the man, quote, teleported. But what do you think happened here? Did this news station capture a person teleporting live on TV? Or is there another explanation? Leave a comment below with what you're thinking. Follow the music. Crazy. This next creepy video comes from the real. YouTube channel Chasing the Darkness. It's Levi time. and his friend Joe time venture travel, out to conduct a paranormal investigation real. at the infamous right. Letchworth Village Cemetery. For the first part of the video, the pair use a K2 meter and spirit box and call out to any spirits that may reside in the cemetery and they get a lot of strange responses. However, a little later into the video, they decide to make their way over to the asylum building and capture something rather creepy hello so hey music playing i think there's people here yeah time to go oh my god i hope my article catches because right here i hope your article catches too bro because Hello? Anybody here? We just come to investigate this place. Why? For fucking what? For for fucking why? What, what's the point? What? What? I just come to investigate the place. What? Why? What? What? For the name of content. <laughs> oh my god. God damn it. Oh my god. To the music is wild. 
As soon as the pair step inside, the sounds of music can clearly be heard playing, but where is it coming from? The pair press on, keen to find out where the music was coming from, and a short while later, they captured this on camera. At some point, you're just gonna have people living in there, scare people. I know, man. So this doesn't feel right. So dude, did you hear that? Dude. It's like footsteps? Footsteps. Because it's one <gasps> in front of us. It's Joe and Levi are exploring the Letchworth Village Asylum. A mysterious dark figure crosses their path, but the pair don't see it. Although, at the time, they heard footsteps walking right in front of them. The pair were understandably horrified when they viewed the footage back and noticed this mysterious dark figure walking right in front of them. Chasing the Darkness claims that this is a quote, shadow figure, but what do you think? Did Levi and Joe capture a shadow figure on camera? You tell me. He had like a hunchback too, and he didn't really move like a person because he kind of glitched a little bit, seemed like. What do you think? Did Levi and Joe know. capture a shadow figure on camera? You tell me. Yeah, it was kind of Poltergeist quick, activity. I, the I final know. ghost video in this week's episode of Top 10 Scary Ghost Videos comes from someone I feature regularly, Franco TV. Frank visits one of the most haunted locations in Iowa, the Malvern Manor. Malvern Manor was built as a hotel in the late 1800s, then eventually became a nursing home, a halfway house, and then a care facility for those suffering from mental illnesses before hey. closing for good in 2005. Paranormal activity has been witnessed by dozens of people at the Malvern Manor. Disembodied voices, coughs, footsteps, banging sounds, and eyewitness accounts of shadow figures and full-bodied apparitions have been reported throughout the Malvern Manor. Frank starts his exploration inside the haunted Malvern Manor alone, or so he thought. I'm gonna use the K2 because this thing goes off like crazy here. And I wanna see if it will do the same thing. Now, is that a creeper? <laughs> That's a creeper. I think I remember in this room there was a doll that used to be laying on the bed. Maybe a patient was here and... What was it? There's noise. There's nothing in this room either. Look at this. And that toy keeps going off. So I'm gonna take the toy with me and I wanna see if this thing goes off. Can you move the ball or pick it up? Funny if you throw it back. All I want to do. Holy sh Are you messing with me? Is that you? Well, clearly, ain't nobody else there. No thanks. No thanks. No you thanks. don't want to play with me. That's fine. Dead. You're dead? Obviously. It's not nah. like I said, no thanks, I'm dead. Yeah. 
while Frank is exploring the Malvern Manor. A child's toy turns on all on its own. He decides he's going to carry the toy with him and moves to another part of the building. A few minutes later, Frank throws a ball in the hopes that if a child ghost is around, that it might decide to play with it. Then, as Frank goes to pick up the ball, a sound behind him startles him. He spins around, but no one's there. Only the sound of creepy laughter can be heard coming from the dark corridor in front of him. Frank asks if the ghost is messing with him and if it wants to play. A voice comes through saying no thanks and dead. But what happens next is truly creepy. At this point now, I'm going to make my way to the second floor. I've been down here for a couple of hours now and uh, I want to see what's going to happen on the second floor. So I brought some toys with me. This is the creepy floor. Looks like I it. I hate this floor. This is where you pretty much hear a lot of the footsteps. Walking down as you're just kind of like in a room or something. This is where a lot of that tends to happen. I right. just now put the toy there. That has went on a couple of times and I think it went on in one of my last videos as well. I want to see if it does the same thing this one. Um, I'm going to close the door. And I do have this ball here that I'm going to use for instigating. Could you tell me your name? Who am I speaking with? I know you're here with me in the room. Just talk, talk to me and tell me your name. Who's Anna? The door just opened. The door that you're in? Hello? After a few hours, Frank makes his way up to the second floor where apparently a lot of the activity right. occurs. He brings the toys with him in the hopes of oh, instigating some sort of response. Frank explains that footsteps are often heard in the corridor of the second floor and that a woman sadly passed away in one of the upstairs rooms. Frank decides that this would be the perfect room to continue his investigation in. He puts the touch activated toy on a cupboard and closes the door. Then Frank asks, who am I speaking? with and a female voice comes through his device saying Anna. Before he can say anything more, the door he closed somehow opens all on its own. Frank notices it, but as he's getting up, the toy all of a sudden turns on saying the words hello. Frank decides to move to the other side of the house to continue his investigation and captures this on camera. Do you want me to leave? Josh? It's coming in the room. What is that? Okay, it's nothing. I think. Josh. Josh.
while Frank is investigating the other side of the house. The sounds of someone running can be heard echoing through the area Frank's in. Frank becomes terrified and rushes to check who's there, but no one's around. He ends up back downstairs and then, all of a sudden, captured on Frank's static night vision camera upstairs pointing at the toy, toy can be seen mysteriously turning on by itself and then it rolls off the table, crashing onto the floor directly above Frank. Frank's viewers were on the edge of their seats throughout this investigation at the haunted Malvern Manor, with many agreeing that what ever made those running sounds was likely a spirit that resides in the old building. Frank yeah. says that everything that occurred during his exploration at the haunted Malvern Manor was quote, poltergeist activity. But what do you think? Did Frank capture evidence of paranormal activity at this haunted house? You tell me. Thank you so much for watching today's yeah. video. If you're a fan of scary content, make sure you Yeah, that was that was good. That was good. If you're a fan of scary content, please subscribe to my man, Mind Junkie, okay? Hit that like button if you have watched his video. It doesn't make any sense for him to have 27,000 uh, big views and only... That doesn't make any fucking sense, bro. Like, it's, it's a simple fucking thing to go to the video and hit the like button. Simple fucking task, bro. Simple task. It's free. It's something easy to do. People be bugging. People be bugging. Um, uh, yo, yo. I don't know what some people think. Some people think ghosts aren't real. Some people think they are real. I believe they are real, okay? I believe that there's more than just the realm that we are in right now. It gotta be more, all right? There's, and then there has to be an explanation for um, Smuggy, uh, the guy, that had his daughter on the couch with him and the two figures that ran up the stairs or teleported up the stairs really fast. Like, there, there has to be an explanation. Or no explanation, okay? Like, come on. Come on, bro. Like, he, they, this, what? He just fucking, they both just fucking, and was gone. Wow. Wow. Amazing. Amazing. Um, y'all let me know what y'all think though in the comments, man. Like, subscribe, share all that stuff. I let your boy catch your next video. Shout out to Mind Junkie, shout out to Casper Sight. Um, because those totem figure green moving motherfuckers, wild, right? Wild. <laughs> Everything about this crazy video is amazing. Um, but yeah, yeah, great video overall, great video well you put together uh, if you made it this far you are a goat and i appreciate you hopefully you enjoyed the reaction hopefully you enjoyed the commentary um, if you believe in ghosts let me know in the comments if you believe in ghosts also hit the like button right you know what i'm saying i let your boy